What are you eating? What are you having? You having a huge rice cake? Yes. <clears throat> yes, yes, yes. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, you gonna, well, I'm gonna be working on, you know, my, my new designs and um, yeah, you can just watch me working on my new headbands. I just came back from Cyprus, I got some fabrics from there. Um, I just love going to the fabric store and watching our different fabrics I just love it like, I love it and I might not be making any money from it yet at least you know but I just do it because I, I like it I love it and hopefully one day that will pay off hopefully and uh yeah mm. Okay, I just want to go to that shop, grab some coffee, because after coming back from Cyprus and testing, tasting all the nice coffee, I still need my coffee fix, I still need my good coffee, just a little treat for me, you know, um, something that keeps me going, so we're going to do that, I'm going to go grab a coffee and then we're going to come back and show you um yeah if you want to support a mama here support my channel subscribe like this video press the notification button so you get notified every time i post a video and uh let's do it so i started filming and there was an error so the last clip is lost and i'm about to lose my mind and this girl she doesn't want to sleep like it's two o'clock like i just don't know what to do i gave her some tea i thought she was going to sleep she hasn't slept yet so anyway we are back got my coffee here you know to get me through so i just wanted to show you a little bit my workspace you know my little that's all the place i got really so um yeah i've got my dining table obviously where i'm working you know, I'm doing all my sewing, cutting my fabric. Sometimes I cut my fabric on the floor. But because of the little one, she comes, she wants to grab the scissors and she wants to disturb her stuff. It's better if I do on the dining on the dining table. So yeah, um here I got my um uh, you know sheets of paper where I wrap my headbands in. Um and here I've got all my you know the here i've got all my business cards my labels and all that here i've got my um you know my purple bags where i package my uh where i pack my headbands and this is recyclable actually these bags so yeah we care about the environment so why not and then and then here I've got all my um, sewing equipment, my threads, rulers, stuff like that, you know, scissors. That's my cutting board, which I'm going to take out in a minute. And then here I've got all my, all the samples I make, all headbands that I'm planning to sell. And then here I've got all my fabrics, still a bit of a mess. I've got different, different kinds of fabrics but it's a bit messy because I don't have much space I usually keep my velvets at the back and at the front I've got my cottons and um, yeah I've got this fabric as well this satin which I don't know I'm still trying to think what to do with it I might make some scrunchies or I might do like two face kind of uh two-sided headband so one side is satin the other side is you know one of the cotton fabrics i have and uh yeah these are my you know newest additions <laughs> the newest fabrics that i got from cyprus 
Yes, you want to be on the camera. You want to touch the camera. Oh, nice. Nice, okay. So, yeah. I've got this. Look at this satin. This lovely petrol like color. It's beautiful. Can't hey, wait hey. to walk with it. And then I've got some more spring summery colors. Uh, yeah. So, the headphones I'm going to be working with today is these two. You know fabrics oh, yeah those hurt heart fabrics um, yeah which I want to I'm planning to do it today possibly by tomorrow so I can sell it for Valentine's Day hopefully I can sell some and um, yeah that's what we're doing so yep let's get these two and work on them then another day I will work on the rest ones so yep I don't know if I get distracted and like didn't eat. I was so pissed. I'd be like, oh my god. <laughs> um, and now with her, it's the same. Like, I know her first nap is like around 40 minutes. Jesus. I know that her first nap is like around 35, 40 minutes. And that's exactly like my time where I get my breakfast. Hopefully Tyson is already like fed and everything. We're going to a daycare from um, 8 to 11. So that gives me a little extra time in the morning. And really so I'm trying to cut my fabric with this rotary cutter. This is rubbish. Like it's already broken. Like I have to change it. Um, but yeah, I prefer to cut my fabrics with the rotary cutter than, the, than scissors. So I fold my fabric in half and then cutting a fabric is the most annoying thing for me because um, yeah, I never know. Best way. Yeah, I don't know. The best way of doing it quicker. It's good. At the same time, I'm feeding her. Place. There's some places that it doesn't cut, so I just yeah, it's not ideal, but it's okay. That be that should be. I'll cut it in two pieces for the headband. And then I'm gonna cut another piece for the scrunchie. So now I'm just gonna change my uh, the blade for my rotary cutter. Uh, maybe it will make a difference, you know, because it's just oh, I can feel how sharp it is. What's this one. Yeah, it might work a little bit better, you know, it's rubbish. Um, yeah, you gotta be careful with those things. So I'm cutting my scrunch now. I'm cutting the large size, so I've got different sizes. And I'm just gonna cut the large one, it's still big. But it's not as big as the, you know, XL and XXL. <laughs> what is it, baby? Look 
that straight to me. Okay. So, it's been a long time since I put it on my back. But, sometimes you have to do that. Because she's tired and she doesn't know it. And she needs to sleep. So, and I need to work. So that's the best way I can do it right now. So, yeah. She should soon sleep. I'm telling you. So anyway, that's my fabric from for my large scrunchie. Uh, the length is too long, so I have to cut 76 centimeters of that as well. So one meter can do another one, two, another four headbands, maybe four headbands. Um, yeah. So yeah, let me cut this. Five minutes later, what did I tell you? So I've cut all my fabric for two scrunchies, two headbands. So um, yeah, I took out my sewing machine. So now I'm gonna start sewing the light, uh, you know, color because I've got the this thread so yeah i'm gonna put the black thread after i finish with the you know light color headbands so yeah let's do this at the same time i'm filming on my phone so i can upload on tiktok or instagram or yeah so yeah busy mom here little piece is where the elastic will go and first thing I do I put the label so I'm gonna sew it with that I'm just gonna put the label somewhere in the middle and then fold it in half and just sew them together so yeah let's see where the middle is and, uh, Usually we fold it. These labels, I ordered them from eBay. Um, I can list the buyer, the seller down below. So if you are interested, um, yeah. um, I'm happy with it for the moment being I don't know I'm thinking about changing my packaging my designs and all that because obviously it's not perfect and I'm aware of that but that's just the start so um, yeah there's always room for improvement Yes. So I'm just securing it in place with these clips. Let me put the camera a little bit closer. Yeah, there you go. That's a better view. So yeah, just clip it in place like that. Then I fold it in half. So then together. of time but Then I carry on with the rest of the pieces. The good thing about curtain is that 
it's very easy to sew like doesn't slip away or anything like that so I used to put pins and everything you know when I first started um, but yeah now I feel more confident in just you know just folding in half and just sew it especially with cotton it's so easy time I'm trying to set up my phone and film a few videos for TikTok and all that so yeah Spend hours drinking coffee, right? Okay. Now I need to turn those fabrics the other way around. Okay, let me just cut this excess just from the label. This is my safety pin. Get it through there. it is hugging out that's the label so what I do I grab my safety pin I set and yeah you see the label that's where the elastic will go so that's the next step I'm gonna grab my elastic I'm using 2.5 centimeter elastic um, grab my safety pin again it looks too small but Secure the elastic for a minute. Um, one sec. I'm just gonna stitch it here so I can secure the elastic with a zigzag um, stitch. Uh, that's something I've recently started doing. Uh, which I find, I find them so helpful and also if the fabric frays that will keep it from fraying so yeah that's what it is I'll just do it like I don't even bother like looking there Bed, it's just to secure it for the moment being. And that's my elastic band 
that would be nice as a scrunch too isn't it like could be a nice little cute like mini scrunchy but yeah anyway as for now um just need to turn those the other way as well that's just easy to just turn it with your don't need to use a pin or anything like that film here at the same time Sometimes I feel that I'm so slow. But you need to pay attention to detail. Everything needs to be neat and tidy. And um yeah, so now yeah, I'm do it. Yes. So now close up. I'm just going to fold this like that. Just gonna straight stitch it. So I must see machine going back to my going back to my straight stitch. This part I'm doing a few stitches because I want to make sure the thread won't come out. I'm doing on the other side as well. Nearly there, and I'll take the other one. I have to get through it like, like that to get through, hold it. Then. I have to do it this so I can see where the elastic will go. And then I'm gonna cut this. I want to make sure I got all the layers of fabric with the elastic. Um, and then I just cut the excess fabric. Doesn't look too bad anyway. Don't need to cut. I don't need to cut much. Then I just flip it the other way. Just turn it the other way. And yeah, there you have it. Just need to. Yay! I always love seeing the, you know, the final result. So now, yeah. Beautiful. I think I'm gonna finish them all today and take pictures and upload them today because it's Thursday, it's the 10th and um, Maybe some people want to have it by Valentine's Day to give for gifts or to wear them or whatever. So I'm gonna try and do that. That's quickly as possible 
I was planning to do that I mean earlier but obviously I was on holidays and I came back on Tuesday and I was too tired to do anything on Tuesday yesterday I was tidying up the whole day so yeah okay let's go ahead with the matching scrunchie so I used to I used to follow a different method but now I've learned the burrito burrito method um, I was scared to try that first I thought it was complicated I thought it wasn't easy but once you do it once I mean it's quite easy so I'm just gonna use the burrito method yeah so yeah I'm just gonna stitch across the wind of the fabric now for the scrunchies I leave the labels for last because there's a bit where you have to close it you know so um, I just um, yeah I just leave it once because I just put the label where it closes my battery is dying so I won't be able to film this so I'm, go I'm just gonna charge it for a bit and then um, and then show you the other you know headband is crunchy later yeah so yeah let me charge my battery and I'll be right back hey so she just woken up I give it a yogurt to eat um, I will still be filming a video what my year old eat because now we are more consistent with eating and uh, I'm more clear with you know how she eats the meals the and all that um, yes so just woken up I've managed to finish the two headbands and one scrunchie so I just have one scrunchie left which I want to show you how I'm doing it and, and yeah because that's I showed you how I'm doing the headband and all that so I'm just gonna show you how I'm doing the scrunchie and that's it okay let me I'm just preparing some tea for her and I'll be right back this crunchy actually complements it and uh, they, they fit well together anyway that's the darker one and that's the pink one I don't know why I said darker instead of saying like blue one and this pink one you know yep it's cute isn't it so cute my scrunchy Ooh. oh my god <sighs> yeah my scrunchy I use a pong 1.3 centimeter elastic and um I'm not sure which one I prefer two centimeters or 1.3 centimeter the two centimeter it holds the hair better but it's a bit can feel a bit tighter but I don't know I'm not sure yeah I don't know anyway let's just do the burrito scrunchie now I mean the other scrunchie you know the burrito scrunchie it's not like first I need to change her cuz yeah she she had a poo. It's a little bit of a mess here. I've got some laundry that needs to be, you know, put in place, a few dishes, and here, you know, cares. But I mean, it's fine. And yeah, I just wanted to show you for a minute the beautiful sky of London. Look at the clouds. Beautiful beautiful but anyway I'm doing an eye shift today so yeah which I'm feeling very depressed about but it is what it is unfortunately we have to work what can we do anyway now I want to change the thread um, yeah I want to put black thread I've already have a book bobbin that is black I need to get more bobbins so I can um, sometimes I don't have enough 
I have to undo some bobbins and you know it's not really ideal so um, yeah but I'm just giving her some apple she loves apples she loves fruits and um yeah she's quite sweet too you know all right so I was doing my scrunchie earlier the other one and I realized that my bobbin thread has run out but I kept sewing sewing and then I realized that it wasn't sewn at the end so I have to I have to redo it so annoying but yeah it happens sometimes that happens that's Iris trying to I don't know why can't they just play with their toys? They just they just always want to try the things. You cannot hit. She just caught. They just want to try all the dangerous stuff, isn't it? Like sometimes, you know, it's not easy at all. It's a little bit too dark. I um, don't know why I don't put the light on. But anyway, this light, the sewing machine. So. just sewn the line here and what I do next I um, take this <laughs> Iris please let me do this thing this seam it's face down and then I just fold a piece in the middle Iris, please let me do it. <laughs> Just fold it like this and then I fold the inside and then I fold I don't know how to explain it but anyway that's just how I'm doing it. Stop touching this I align you know where the closing is they need to sit at the right like anyway okay you can find plenty of tutorials I don't need to explain to you how to do I'm just you know, I'm showing you a working day at home with the one year old you know no, way. no, not touching. Got a few seconds to sew that before she comes here. She's coming. I'm so, uh, I'm gonna leave a gap as well now. So let me look threads. No. No. That's it. It's okay, it's okay. I'm 
hi guys uh, I was just editing this video and I've realized that um, yeah there is a video missing like I haven't finished explaining how to you know do the scrunchie and all that so so yeah I don't know what happened I think I've deleted some videos by accident um, yeah so sorry about that I'm just gonna show you the final you know um, the final uh, scrunchy their final outcome and um, yeah unfortunately um, I'll probably maybe in the future if you're interested I can show you you know uh, like maybe a tutorial a more like detailed uh, tutorial on how to maybe do a headband or scrunchy uh, yeah I can maybe consider doing that in the future but yeah as for now sorry about that i just wanted to let you know and um uh, and yeah hope you enjoyed this video and don't forget to like uh, subscribe press the notification button um and all that and thank you so much for watching see you in the next one bye I majored in situations and, and things, situations that just got me so twisted. I wasn't listening either. I was holding that man hostage. He'll put some weird doctor in a strip mall in Tallahassee, right? We do that when we, on some level, know that we can't tell the truth, truth, truth about the reality of situations. All night long, yeah. We dance with our razor tongues and all day long